they're obviously good, but um, I think it's just us, you know, getting caught in rotations uh, from time to time. I feel like we got to do better in our rotations and also better on ball defense so that they can't get the pass through so clear. I wanted to ask you, you know, Northwestern is very unique mm -hmm. in the Big Ten. They kind of run stuff that nobody else really runs. Uh, you only, you know, when you get ready to play them, how different is preparation for them? Uh, it's very different. You know, they play defense differently than, uh, than any other team. Really, you know, they run that one three one. Where they um, where they speed teams up a little bit, you know, past their comfort level, and then also on the offensive end, they you know they're different uh, as far as like back doors and stuff like that. So um, I mean, we're gonna we're gonna prepare for them and we have to get ready for them. It's a difficult prep, isn't it? Uh, yeah, it's definitely a different a different you know preparation for it. But you know, we got to go in here, watch the film, and see what they've been doing best um, with their new guard. But um, we just got to prepare for it. Last thing for me, uh, it seems like. I know you missed a big one the other night, but it seems like your free throws are a little bit better. Do you feel like it's starting to come a little bit? Uh, yeah, um, I, I just feel like every game, you know, just taking my time at the free throw line, it, that helps me out. Um, and also making them also, you know, gives me more confidence for the next time I'm going up to shoot them. So I feel like I've been doing better at that. When you um, you know, just the crowd, they say, you know, it's, it's a wild crowd. And also um, the, the energy that they give the players, you know, they say, uh, that's that's really something that we have to be ready to deal with. But uh, we've been in, in big arenas, you know, we're ready to play. It's, with with a difficult road game, how important is it to yet again get off to a good start? Um, uh, it's, it's, it's very important, you know. Um, you don't get the calls and things that you want on the road. And also, um, you have to be ready for whatever they might bring. You know, they might come with something different. So, And then, you know, this year we haven't got really a lot of road wins, so it's very important for us to pick up this win. And there, there's certain things that like I get lost in, like uh, on the helpline stuff like that. But it just comes with experience, really. You know, um, not having uh, much of a chance to do that last year. Practice, you know, it's not the same as games. So I think uh, the more and more I play, uh, I'll pick it up. You're able to make a couple big shots during the second half. Was that, I guess, that kind of give you confidence going into the rest of the season? Oh uh, yeah. I it, ever lacked it. Yeah, I, I don't say it, I never lacked confidence, but at times, you know, I, I might have second guessed some things, right. but. Uh, you know, it definitely feels good to hit some shots and, you know, get some points uh, on the board. But, um, you know, it's more to that. I, I just want to win. You know, I don't like losing. I haven't lost this much ever. Um, I mean, we've had some breakdowns that have been um, kind of unexplainable just because they've been so, um, I guess, simple. Just easy things like losing your man off of a, a basket where we've been, you know, in the flow of the game or, or just something where it's kind of, you know, I guess, um, not what we've been about for the last five years. So um, I think just little breakdowns like that have really like, cost us. Hey, it's not just been one person making the same mistake you're talking about. There have been multiple problems in switching or whatever, right? For sure, yeah. It's, it's, uh, it's not like, you know, it's been one guy. It's, like you said, it's been, it's been almost everybody. So. What the last thing for me that they're difficult to play against. I mean, the preparation for them is unlike anybody you really prepare against in the Big Ten. Mm -hmm. How how different is? I mean, how much concentration it takes keen concentration to prepare to play them? Does it? yeah, and you have to be you're incredibly locked into the scouting report, um, incredibly locked in uh, out in the walkthroughs and and in the breakdowns for for their backdoor stuff because they can really they can embarrass you, and, and I've seen it happen. To, to guys on our team, I mean, it's happened to me. It's happened to guys that we've watched on TV. I mean, it happens to everybody. So, um, if you're not ready, though, they'll, they'll really take advantage of you quick. Excellent. It seems like their offense is always to what you guys try to do defensively. It's almost counterintuitive, right? When you're aggressive, that's what they pray off. Exactly. So um, we kind of have to change up what we do a little bit. Um, in the past, we've kind of tried to stay beneath them while pressuring the ball, so that if they backdoor, they backdoor through your chest. Um, but like you said, it is something that. They're really preying on what we kind of pride ourselves on, so it can be.